you go to google home this works only for android devices by the way and then you go to routines you can set up your routine like for me i set up a radio one unfortunately you cannot set it to and detect azan timing so what you can do is actually for example radio 2 for me is the whore i have two options i can either talk to google home and tell them radio 2 or it goes by time so i set a time at 12 50 my radio will start to turn on to 94.2 okay so this is what time and these are the days that you want it to be activated what do you want it to do so i set it to tune in to 94.2 which is warna and also adjust volume to 50 because sometimes previously we set it to lower so i want to set it to 50 so at this time which is 12 50 my radio will turn on by itself okay so i have already set timing for subo okay i also have a routine to set um, light to be automatically off so the advantage of this is for me whenever we go on a holiday what we do is we will leave our wi-fi and google home devices on so even though we are not at home the azan will still be playing at home at the time that is supposed to play okay what our um, just now was talking about timing so what you do is you just take the one five minutes before the earliest one okay and then you also have to set a stop so because once just now for zohor 12 50 it will start so you need to set a stop also so my stop is at 13 30 which is 1 30 pm so this stop should be five minutes after the latest zohor timing throughout the year so what i do is every year i will go through this setting to see that if it's still um, within the prayer timings for the year and then the google home will take care of all the azan prayer so azan timing and it will automatically play on the unit so once the system switch on the unit on your phone it will give a notification that it has started on google home itself the radio has started i will go over there and take a recording semua dia orang settle bagus kami menjanjikan khidmat penuh amanah